Easy. Nick, why is it working? I don't know. There it is. So this shelf, this is the bacon shelf. <laughs> the ham shelf. Ooh. The rib shelf. Yum. We haven't even got the sausages yet. <laughs> this is all pork chops and pork wine. Wow. And then berries. <laughs> Somebody had to buy fruit to contaminate the meat for you. Okay. <laughs> we picked our three piggies up from the butcher. I don't think we call them piggies anymore. I do. No. <laughs> oh, uh, homeless. Grandpa's here helping Nick. And we had to buy a new freezer to fit it all. Yeah, same more the same. Honey, don't eat that. Bernie. <laughs> don't come out either. <clears throat> our, our family has been a little bit sick in the last week. Or a lot sick, I guess. But when I came out to do the chores tonight, I realized that it was getting colder. It's going to be about, well, in between minus 9 and minus 12 tonight. And because Bernie's gonna be all by herself, we decided to come out and give her some fresh bedding so she can stay warm. Here you go, girl. Bernie making her bed. Okay, Bernie. Good night, Bernie. Birds are asleep. Oh, we left his um, halter on. We were out here with the horses, Amelia and I, today, brushing okay. them and working with them. But we don't like to keep their halters on. It's a sure way of getting them snagged on something. Good night, Zach. Remember that round bale feeder we welded up last week? Yep, this is the same one. The cattle are supposed to reach through like this. Not like this. Unfortunately, Grandma had some trouble with the camera, so we actually didn't get the footage of getting this little guy out of here. This actually looks worse than it was. Luckily, we were able to rotate his front shoulders 90 degrees clockwise and then bring his front legs back towards the feeder and his back legs just slipped right out. Easy, 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 easy. Easy. Whoa. Whoa. Hold on, 
my goodness. What, is that your calf? And there's the calf back with 